A recent study reveals Wisconsin's hospital costs are among the highest in the country. But that study has also received pushback from a number of organizations, including two area hospitals. News 9's Isaac Dinesen has a look at what both sides are arguing. So at the heart of this, one of the conclusions of that study is that consumers are paying well above average for their visits to hospitals. But those who oversee those hospitals feel that data in the study does not paint an accurate picture. This is a study from the Rand Corporation, who compiled data from hospitals across the country from 2020 to 2022. It found patients in Wisconsin pay more than three times the Medicare rate. That's the fifth highest in the country. It's very concerning, not only for patients, but also for employers who are trying to provide quality, affordable health care for their employees. Rand's findings indicate Wisconsin ranks well above neighboring Midwest states, such as Iowa and Michigan, who rank second and third lowest. But those in central Wisconsin bear an even higher cost compared to the rest of the state. In the Wausau area, Aspirus is the fourth highest hospital system for cost at 368% of Medicare. That data is as of 2022, where Marshfield Clinic came just behind them at 338%. We reached out to both Aspirus and Marshfield Clinic for comment, but each would defer to comments from the Wisconsin Hospital Association and American Hospital Association. The AHA describes it as an apples to oranges comparison and a, quote, inflated impression of what hospitals are actually getting paid. The WHA says the study's data set is extremely limited, claiming it only accounts for 1% of outpatient visits statewide from 2022. It adds Medicare's rates don't fully cover costs from providers, hence the high prices. The WMC says that shouldn't fall on the ones who need care. There's no reason that employers and privately insured individuals should have to be making up for low reimbursement costs. If they have a problem with low reimbursement costs, they should go to the government and have that conversation with them. She says the best way to create progress on the issue is to demand transparency from hospitals. And Vervelde adds that consumers need to be able to shop around for the level of care that they need, but not enough data is publicly available for them to be able to make those decisions. Live in studio, Isaac Dinesen, News 9 WAOW.